That old saying goes, it's not how you start, it's about how you finish. And for San Antonio FC, that held true on Saturday night. After a 2-0 lead in the first half, they would collapse in the second half as RGV came back and took a point, making it a 2-2 draw at the end of the match. I caught up with a very frustrated and disappointed SAFC head coach, Darren Powell, after the match. But bottom line is you get a point. It's a draw. So, you know, we have to use that point and... You know, everyone's precious. Did we want three? Absolutely, we do every week. So there's no, that doesn't change. That attitude doesn't change. And you saw the guys' attitude didn't change in, in the last 10 minutes of the game, trying to get three points. So, yeah, those games are, are, are hard, but it's a game. It's one point. We have to move on, and we have to get ready for next Saturday. Yeah, of course, it's, uh, it's that easy to get over this. Um, we had the game. We're up 2-0, and we're up a man. But unfortunately, the things didn't go as we planned at the end. Uh, just, I would say it's, it's, we need to do better as a group in that. And hope gotta look, like you said, he's got to look forward for the next game. It's going to be a tough game against New Mexico. Um, you know, when you're on the field, we're all men. And um, there's no, you know, there's no, there's not much more room for growing pains. There's not much more room for lessons learned. Um, you know, the good news is, you know, there's plenty more soccer to play. Uh, but we can't keep saying that, um, you know, we still have home advantage uh, playing against a good team. Uh, but a team that's very beatable. Uh, we have all to play for, and this is going to take a Herculean effort from everybody. Um, you know, not just for this game, but to to remain consistent. San Antonio FC will now stay home at Toyota Field next weekend for a huge match against New Mexico United. And it's for the standings. There's three points separate the two teams, so there's no telling what could happen. Reporting from Toyota Field for the Project Spurs Network, I'm Steven Anderson.